You're live. Good afternoon. I'm Shirley Kleppe here. We're in my studio. And uh, I've put the final touches on uh, my most recent painting. The title of this is called The Back Street of Portofino. Very interesting painting with a lot of dynamics to it, a lot of light and darks, a lot of very, very difficult architecture to capture. This is a full size sheet of watercolor paper. It's cold press arches watercolor paper. And it's been mounted on a piece of illustration board that's mounted onto a piece of masonite. And I always grid it off underneath to make sure I get my tape lines exactly perpendicular and square. I did go ahead and project this image and then I corrected it with a T-square and a triangle to make sure that everything was in uh, direct right and left angles. When I started the painting, I decided to go with the, the darkest area of the painting, which is over here to the far right. This was a very difficult for me to do because I, I work in layers. So I layered this and layered this and then started picking other areas moving over to the left. I worked the areas up in here and here, then the areas up in here, layering and layering and layering, paying, paying attention to the light and dark areas. I did eliminate a lot of other extraneous things with wires and and other just junk in a painting that you should eliminate that don't add anything to it. This original photograph had a drop of the 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 awning on the side. And in my preliminary painting, I had that in there after discussing this with uh, another artist and looking at this, I decided to take it out, which left a lot of areas ambiguous to me. Nevertheless, I didn't try to put too much detail in, but enough, enough that would suggest that there was, these were shops. Obviously, this is a uh, restaurant right here. And we've got uh, apartments up here where the women put their laundry out. It, has several this is a, a colonnade right here that was a walk through obviously there's apartments above here this is a separate apartment building so is this this is a different one with the, the yellow front on it the italians are famous for uh painting the their buildings various bright colors since the light is coming from almost direct directly above it does have the the angle of reflected light this all this light underneath here is going to all this dark underneath here is very dark without getting it too dark and uh, getting slick looking the the lights coming down obviously it hits the wall on the other side but i'm not really sure how much light actually got on that other wall so i basically made this area in shadow too. In my detail uh, photograph, it does show that this, this side is somewhat darker than this side. The light's coming through like this. It's probably more or less coming through like this. It's coming through like this, hitting it like this, rather than coming through it down like this. So the floor was the last to go in which these are just basically stone pavers through here. And this area right here was a cobblestone. I elected not to put a lot of texture in that uh, just because it would just have too much texture going on here to take away from all the other texture that's going on. Um, maybe it's time to sign it. So let's go over here and uh, excuse my drawing table 
And this is the moment that I always look forward to. Right here, I will sign my pen name, Outrageous Red. So, here we go. So down here, I will put the back street of Portofino. And we are in October. What's the date on this? October 16th. October 16th, 2018. There you go. There we are. That's We're it. finished. Thank you.